Chapter 835 All Treasures Gathered Shai Bai had opened wide the gates to the Forsaken God Clan, allowing the heroes of the world to observe this battle. This was so they could all be witnesses to avoid a situation where the Azura Divine Kingdom began to desperately lash out once they lost. But now, more and more heroes from the entire continent arrived in piling droves. Many of these were the famed elders of large sects and the heroic young elites known throughout the Divine Kingdoms. Every single one of these characters was a talent of their era. So many people gathered together wasn't necessarily beneficial for Lin Ming to break through to life destruction. When a martial artist was crossing life destruction, that was an extremely dangerous point when they were at their most vulnerable. This was why they needed to maintain their top mental state throughout. If there was too much external influence then it could possibly create a negative pressure on the martial artist instead. These days, Shai Bai could faintly feel that Lin Ming's process of crossing life destruction wouldn't be as easy as he thought it would be. Otherwise, why would he accept two god transforming pills from Yang Yun, and use more than ten days to recover his soul wound and adjust his state? No matter what it was, everything would become clear in these next three days. Shai Bai looked at the sky and then walked towards where Lin Ming was closed up. This was the best seclusion spot in the entire Forsaken God Clan. It was built in an extremely firm and defensible Great Tower. This tower was located at the very center of the Dimensional Realm Spirit Veins, and the Heaven and Earth Thorgen energy was incomparably pure and rich here. Not just that, but there were layers upon layers of protective array formations surrounding this seclusion spot. There was a very long history behind these arrays. 100,000 years ago, an ancestor of the Forsaken God Clan had laid it down. It was called the Skylock Array. Once it was activated, it would have ghostly and immeasurable functions. If a peerless powerhouse were to manage it then it could even trap gods and seal immortals. Although the current power of the array wasn't as glorious as it used to be, with the Divine Sea Powerhouses of the Forsaken God Clan managing it, it could resist the joint attack of six or seven Divine Sea Powerhouses. It was hard to defend against the thoughts and desires of others. Shai Bai had activated the Skylock Array in order to guarantee that Lin Ming would have absolute safety when he crossed life destruction. Unfortunately, arranging this array formation required specific array flags, and a method of producing these array flags had already been lost to time. The entire Forsaken God Clan only had four of these array flags. Otherwise, if they could cover up the entire dimensional realm in a Skylock Array, Shai Bai wouldn't even fear waging war with the Azura Divine Kingdom, Patriarch. A guard immediately saluted as he saw Shai Bai. Shai Bai stepped straight into the seclusion chamber. There were a massive number of runes drawn into the ground here aimed at increasing the heaven and earth origin energy, as well as secret techniques that could increase the chances of one successfully crossing life destruction. Lin Ming sat at the center of these runes. Two old men stood on the left and right of him, acting as his protectors. These two people were both proficient in support spheres. One could increase a martial artist's physical strength and the other could enhance a martial artist's soul force and will. These two people were carefully selected by Shai Bai to serve as Lin Ming's help in crossing life destruction. There were thousands of spear and stones set around Lin Ming, as well as five jade boxes of various sizes. One of these boxes contained the two god transforming pills lent by Yang Yun. Lin Ming was saving his final strength. Patriarch Shai Bai. Lin Ming felt Shai Bai arrive and began rising to greet him. No need to stand up. Shai Bai saw Lin Ming's solemn expression and was able to confirm his own guess. It seemed that Lin Ming's crossing of life destruction would not be easy at all. He didn't ask why it would be so difficult for Lin Ming to cross life destruction, but instead waved his hand and then took out an ordinary looking wooden box from his spatial ring. Upon opening it, a translucent crystal gem was revealed, around the size of half a pinky finger. But as this crystal gem appeared, it actually bloomed with a brilliant radiance as if the laws of the world were changing around it. Top grade spear essence stone? Lin Ming's pupils shrank. He was only able to vaguely confirm this. There were three ranks of spear essence stones. Ordinary, superior, and top grade. Superior spear essence stones were already rare. A superior spear essence stone was equivalent to 300 ordinary spear essence stones, and top grade spear essence stones were far, far rarer. A top grade spear essence stone was the source of a spear essence stone mine. They had basically all but vanished from the world. It was already amazing if an entire spear essence stone mine could produce a single top grade spear essence stone. This was a treasure that even a divine sea supreme elder would turn berserk with red for. It was enormously beneficial to help a martial artist make a breakthrough. Shai Bai said. It's only a small piece. It's around equal to one-sixth of a standard top-grade spear essence stone. Patriarch Shai Bai. This is, little brother Lin. Don't be pressured. I already feel that your aura isn't too stable. This isn't like you at all. Shai Bai gently patted Lin Ming's shoulder. As Lin Ming approached his breakthrough, it would be a blatant lie to say that he wasn't feeling the pressure around him. The heretical god Sprout had stored the power of thunder from the golden red lightning 90 miles deep into the Thunder Dominion. The reason that Emperor Ardent's relics hadn't been discovered for tens of thousands of years at that 90 mile Thunder Dominion region was not because those Divine Sea Supreme Elders couldn't find them, but rather that they didn't have a method to investigate the 90 mile Thunder Dominion area. From this it could be seen just how horrifyingly powerful the Golden Red Lightning was. If enough of this lightning was gathered, then it could slay even a Divine Sea Supreme Elder. If Lin Ming were to detonate this energy within him to disintegrate his body and be reborn into his spirit body, then the risks could be imagined. Moreover, he had never heard of this situation in the realm of the gods before. There was no previous path taken to guide him. The martial artists in the realm of the gods that duo cultivated body and law cross life destruction by having enough heavenly materials with them. They weren't like Lin Ming, relying on controlling a devastating and ruinous power. In this situation, how could Lin Ming not be earnest? This is for you, to ensure that you are absolutely successful. Shai Bai said as he passed the wooden box into Lin Ming's hands. Lin Ming held onto the box with both hands and looked at the top grade spear essence stone within. 
The surface of this crystal gem seemed to be covered entirely in a mysterious pattern. It had a faint hint of the charm that the Chaos Stone and Time-worn Phoenix City had. Although it was far inferior to the exquisite and profound nature of a Chaos Stone, it still proved just how extraordinary this top-grade Spear Tessin Stone was. Just one-sixth of a top-grade Spear Tessin Stone had such an effect. No wonder it could cause even divine sea supreme elders to fight for it. Before Lin Ming could speak, Shai Bai interrupted him and said, Don't decline. The value of the Argent White Sword you returned is far more than the value of this stone. Moreover, I have a selfish reason for helping you. Your current status could be called mighty to the point of being unapproachable. Once you pass this trial, you will surely cross into the Divine Sea. When that time comes, I fear you may quickly become the highest under the heavens. But as for me, I am doomed to a much shorter life, while you will live for 10,000 years. I only hope that perhaps you could look after my forsaken god clan in the future. As Shai Bai spoke, there was neither sadness nor sorrow in his eyes. In his entire life he had always calmly and confidently faced his forsaken god clan's bloodline curse. Outside of the forsaken god clan, when martial artists arrived at old age and near the end of their life, they would go frantic and searching for medicines to extend their lifespan, not hesitating to pay any sky-high price. But the martial artists of the Forsaken God clan did not have this necessity. There were extremely few of their clansmen who could ever live out their natural lifespan. Lin Ming sighed over the unjust destiny that the Forsaken God clan had to bear. He had already firmed his resolve that in the future, when he had strength, he would truly enter the eternal demon abyss and sea of miracles. Not the 1,000 mile forbidden zone or the 8,000 mile black swamp, but the true eternal demon abyss and the true sea of miracles. He would explore and find out just what secrets the absolute life forbidden zones of the sky spell continent and holy demon continent held. The goddess that slumbered, the heart of the great emperor that remained beating for 100,000 years, the god beast like existence that spanned thousands of miles, Lin Ming wanted to explore all of these mysteries. If possible, he even wished to unravel the bloodline curse of the forsaken god clan. Thank you. Lin Ming said these two words and decisively accepted the small top grade spirit essence stone. If favors were owed, they could be returned, but if he lost his life, then he would have nothing at all. At this time, there was no need to be hypocritical. Lin Ming took in a deep breath, opening the jade boxes in front of him one at a time. Among these were two god-transforming pills, a dozen or so sea serpent crystals that he had refined in the 8,000-mile black swamp, as well as the heavens tap demon god bone that Lin Ming had obtained from the 1,000-mile forbidden zone of the eternal demon abyss, in addition with the golden red lightning contained in the heretical god sprout. This was Lin Ming's complete capital for attacking life destruction. As Shai Bai looked at all the various heavenly treasures in front of Lin Ming, he was alarmed. These items were, he deeply looked at Lin Ming, he had thought that the two god-transforming pills Yang Yun had given Lin Ming were already precious enough, but now it seemed as if the treasures Lin Ming brought out were even above the god-transforming pills, in particular that pigeon egg-sized green glass bead. The energy contained within that glass bead was actually several times that of the top-grade spirit essence stone he had gifted Lin Ming. It was basically equal to a complete top-grade spirit stone, with much more to spare. By the heavens, just what sort of treasure was this? Shai Bai searched through his memories but couldn't think of any treasure like this. As a martial artist of the Sky Spill Continent, Shai Bai only knew of wood spear jade. He had never seen a demon god bone before. Shai Bai looked at Lin Ming and then at the items in front of him. These were only from four jade boxes. The last jade box wasn't yet opened. Perhaps the treasure contained within that last jade box was the most valuable of all. Heavens, was he really attacking the life destruction realm and not the divine sea boundary? No. Even someone breaking through to the divine sea wouldn't need such a massive army of resources. He looked at Lin Ming, his eyes filled with shock. He only felt that this youth in front of him had countless secrets on his body. Thinking further about it, for a late revolving core martial artist to reach rank 280 on a destiny degree, a completely unprecedented achievement since the ancient era, then if he didn't have something special about him, how could he possibly have such achievements? As he thought about this and then the heavenly treasures in front of Lin Ming that were emitting a terrifying amount of energy, Shai Bai felt relieved. He sat down opposite Lin Ming and said, Little brother Lin, I shall personally be your protector. Oh, energy revolved. Shai Bai opened his support sphere. This was the bloodline seal of a forsaken god clan, an ability exclusive to their people. With Shai Bai's cultivation, his support sphere naturally far outstripped that of the other two old men. After Shai Bai's energy field was released, Lin Ming felt a warm power flood through his entire body. Every cell in his body began to independently breathe in heaven and earth origin energy. Lin Ming raised his hand and all the ordinary spear tessent stones in the entire chamber began to float in the air. A furious amount of energy manically dissipated into the air. Soon after, these thousands of ordinary spear tessent stones completely turned into ash, releasing a massive flood of heaven and earth origin energy that filled the entire chamber, making this entire room a sea of energy. However, Lin Ming didn't even bother thinking about absorbing this energy. The purity was just too low. Even if Lin Ming absorbed this energy, it would not increase the energy in his dungeon. Instead, the reason that he had released this energy was to provide a nourishing and protective barrier for himself. Lin Ming quietly lifted the two god-transforming pills that Yang Yun had given him. He activated the ethereal martial intent and soon entered into a completely focused state. 